Well, hello, hi, howdy. Uh, me and the boys are on a mission on a big road trip, and this is my first signal. And it's looking pretty nice. I've already had a look at it. It's pretty wiped, but um, oop, good at dropping stuff. I don't know if you can see that, but um, 1877 English penny. There's Vicky there. Look at that. That is not a bad start to a road trip. And uh, hopefully there's many more to come. I've only been detecting for about five minutes and that's my second signal. So very, very happy. Super wiped, but um, we'll carry on and we'll, uh, we'll let you know how we go. Well, there's not too many great signals at the moment. Uh, but I just dug up a really, what looks like a really old uh, shotgun cartridge with a full metal jacket on. I think that's what they call them anyway. Check that out though. That's pretty cool. Yeah. I'll chuck up a photo so you can see a little bit better, but looks pretty old to me. Alright, we'll keep going. Cool, Gary just dug up a signal. And we've, um, well he's come across some other pretty awesome stuff in here. Look at that. Nice old blue glass, a complete vial. Is yeah, that a neck or something? Yeah. That's pretty awesome, eh, man? So, um, could be onto a bottle dump as well. Yeah, certainly some rubbishy crap right here. But the amount of that, the, how thick that glass That's is. That's beautiful, isn't it? Can I look at that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's old as, eh? Sorry. All right, all good. Yeah, look how thick that is. That's incredible. Oh, that'd be nice. Hopefully, when we get onto the mud flats, yeah. we're going to find some whole ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cheers, buddy. Well, I'm not filming too much, sorry about that. Not filming too much because, um, man, it's trashy in here. Uh, but I got a really scratchy signal and um, managed to pull a buckle. It's an iron buckle. But um, there's some awesome age here. Um, as you can tell by the bottles that Gary's pulled out and um, the age of my seven, 1877 uh, penny. Um, but yeah, man, it's just so trashy. Even the metal detectors are all overloading, so much trash right on the surface. But um, at least we can pull this stuff out of the ground, the trusty White's MX Sport. Um, love this machine, um, and it certainly pulls out the goods. So yeah, um, we'll carry on. I can't see anything because that light is so bright, but we'll carry on. <sighs> we're waiting for the tide to go down, then we're going to hit the mud flats. Um, but yeah, we'll keep going. Cool. Oh, that's a pretty unique fine metal detecting, isn't it? Little mini, little mini insulator. Yeah, because of the possible the, the nail going through the center of it. Yeah, that's what the signal would have been. Yeah. Was it a nice signal or kind of just shady? Yeah, no, it was actually. It was uh, like a New Zealand penny kind of, or actually an English penny signal, so sort of mid seventies tone. Yeah, yeah. Oh, cool, man. Awesome. And I just dug up this a little brass drawer knob or something like that. Oh, yep. Yeah. Machinery type things. What are they called? Big wide of them. Oh, yeah, Harrow's? Yeah. yeah, something like that. Awesome. Yeah, awesome. Cool. And you just got an NZ Penny, eh, bro? Yeah, bro. Like about two meters deep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just got a really nice 71 signal. Turn off light. Here we go. Is that a cuff link? Can't really tell. What do you reckon, dude? That's a stud. Is it a stud? I guess I would have gone on both sides or something. Like it's new owner. <laughs> now I'm no expert about this kind of stuff. But I just dug up a signal and came across this. Now that's obsidian. And to me, that looks like it's been worked. Look at that. You can't tell me that hasn't been worked. Sits in the hand nicely to cut. Woo! I haven't even got my signal out yet. But um, that, my friends, is my find of the night so far. I'm convinced that's worked. Look at that. I know it's hard to tell. But, whoa. That is such a cool find. If it is what I think it is, anyway. Oh, man. That's going in the pouch. Hey, while you're here, should we try and find the actual signal? May as well try it live. Oh, I oh, know. Is it something quite dumb? <laughs> a lead head nail head. But man, that is cool. Okay, big reveal. Um, haven't got too much lately. 
um, but I just dug a nice signal. And can you see it in there? Is there going to be a silver? Let's pull it out together. Don't you dare be a one cent coin. Oh my goodness, are you going to be? What are you? Oh, it's a one cent coin. Oh well, they've got my hopes going. But we're going to try and hit the mud flats now. Hopefully there's some nice old stuff in there. Cool, get back to you soon. Well, I've kind of given up a little bit on detecting. But I'm um, finding a bit of glass. Hey, look at that old black glass. The corner to something else. And that looks really old. Look at that. Super thick, super old. And there's black glass everywhere. Ooh, some more over here. Out of a neck. So there's definitely some awesome age in this area. But are we going to find anything whole? That's the quick. Here's another based one. What does that say? Can you guys make that out? Can't really, but um, I know I should be wearing gloves. I took my gloves off so I can use the camera. That's the base as well. Man, there's some old stuff. But it's just trying to find something. Oh, I know I just said that. Let's go explore in here. Blah. What are we doing? We are cra Oh, wow. I'm actually under the root of a tree. Look at that. Isn't that awesome? Mm, there's some good spider webs under here. Nothing I can't handle. Um. Yeah, we need to find something. I think I found like a yum. Uh, where are we? It's in here somewhere. Like an old, super thin, but it's like a brass plaque or something. I don't know if there's anything on it. But it doesn't look like it, but I'll give it a clean. And uh, see if there is. Why don't you walk with me for a little bit and we'll try and find some stuff. Here's a bigger piece. Look at that. That's seriously old. That's got to be 18, well, mid 1800s. Yeah. Huh. Some carpet. I think in some underlay, underlay. Alright. I'll explore a little bit more, and if I find anything else cool, I'll turn it on again. Got a creepy, creepy spider. Can you see her? She's a sheet web spider. I work in a forest deconservation in there. We get them in there. Didn't realize you had them on the coast as well. Pretty big size. But they do get a lot bigger. Yeah, I'm going through a tree tunnel right now. That's where I came from. And I've got to get through those spider webs. I'm checking up on the banks as well. Because um, you never know, you could see a bottle poking out of the side. Uh, no, I don't think that's anything good. But yeah. Um, I walked quite a ways around. And I just didn't find any more glass. So I'm heading back this way. See if we can find any more, any interesting stuff. But yeah. It's not too promising. The MX Sport doesn't seem to want to play ball on the sand. It's filled with iron. Um, yeah, the other two, I don't know if you can see the two lights over there, those two boys there, they've got pulse induction machines, so they work much better on this kind of stuff. Um, some glass. Man, that's old stuff, isn't it? Seriously got some weight to it for such a small piece of glass. It's the weight of a modern day blooming bottle. Let's have a look around here together. I had my hopes up pretty high for the spot to be honest. It's um it's old. Someone we know of reckons she got some uh nice old silvers out of this area. Kind of where the boys are detecting now. But um staircase. But uh yeah. Sadly nothing for us so far. Nothing of too much interest anyway. 
But yeah, thought I'd take you along with me for a little bit anyway, so we can uh, you can see what I can see, which I've just looked at the camera. And it's not too much. <laughs> it's pretty dark. Oh, it's a bit deep there. But then we'll go back onto the shoreline and get closer to the ground. See if we can see some stuff. Hmm. I think we picked that up before. Big old bit of glass. I picked up a big one. Oh, that's, that's more modern stuff, sadly. We don't like modern. Oh, yeah, here's the big one I picked up before. <clears throat> It is so heavy. Look how thick that stuff is. Nearly as thick as my thumb. Hmm. Bit more there. Bit more here. <clears throat> Almost looks like obsidian. Kind of like that awesome obsidian I found before. I'm convinced that's a tool, by the way. Yeah, the boys. A little bit more skeptical. Was a little bit more skeptical, but I found it. So therefore, I know best, right? Um, I don't know if there's anyone you can take that kind of stuff to, you know, to, to check it out. Um, if anyone knows of anyone in the Bay of Plenty area, you can go and talk to to find out if that is old worked tools. Um, let me know, because that'd be cool. Feel free to comment. Let me know if this is a boring video due to the fact that I'm not really finding too much. The 1877 penny had my hopes up pretty high, but then we've really got nothing much since. Sadly, the, uh, the other cool find was the um, the shotgun cartridge, which, like, who gets excited about shotgun cartridges? But it's a pretty cool one. It's got some age. So this is what I'm looking at. Look at all this, all this glass. It's, there's so much of it. Might have picked that bit up before. Another base. Look, it's everywhere. Why are there no whole ones? Well, I know why. Because they're super old and they've been beaten up for over a hundred years. But I was hoping there'd be things like um, pipe stems and stuff, you know? Here's the top to something. A little bit thinner, but still black glass and old. But yeah, I thought you'd take I'd take you along for the ride anyway. But yeah, if I again if I find anything cool, which hasn't happened yet, I'll let you know. Cool. All right. Now I know you guys probably wouldn't believe me if I told you this or showed you this. Uh, we changed locations. We're at a beach now, um, but we're just getting nothing. I found a two-dollar coin and uh, bottle caps a bottle cap and a bit of foil um, and the boys aren't doing much better but I was cruising along here and um, I saw a little glimmer in the sand it's nothing great but you wouldn't believe me it looks like I planted it but this is honestly this is how I came across this 50 cent coin sorry is it a 20 no it's a 20 cent coin um, it's literally sticking out of the sand look at that that's crazy I was hoping for silver but um nah she's a she's a 20 cent coin, that is literally how it was. <laughs> $2.20 in spending money. Awesome. It's a beautiful beach, beautiful night. I know you can't see it, but the stars are out. We'll just pretend those are stars. Stars are out. Um, but the treasure's not here. We'll keep going. We're going to probably call it quits soon and try somewhere else. But uh, yeah, bit of fun. Out with the boys. All right, catch you later. I found myself a little motorbike. I like my motorbikes. This isn't really my style, but much prefer a Harley, but that's cool. And the beach. Man, this uh, MX Sporter doesn't really like the beach much, to be honest. Eh? I found four barks, and those signals sounded okay, but everything else is pretty average. Uh, but I am still beating the boys with their PI machines and everything they've got, Jack. And I've got $4.20 and a motorbike. Happy days.